The topic of tone can be very subjective. What it really comes down to is your own ears to determine what sounds best. Capacitors have been used in circuits to tweak that tone. Traditionally, they're usually around 0.020 for humbuckers or 0.050 microfarads for single coils, but it may not always be the case for your own guitar. If you don't mind experimenting a little bit, here's an idea to help you determine what sounds best. I made this little tester out of an on-on mini toggle switch and two different value capacitors. These lead wires run between my volume and tone pot in place of the old capacitor, and this allows me to toggle back and forth between these two to help me determine which sounds best in the specific guitar. I have the lead wires connected where the capacitor used to be. The other end of the lead wires attached to the common lugs on the switch. The red wire is running from the volume pot. The black lead runs to the tone pot. This is all rigged up now. Let's try it out. What I'm listening for is very slight variations in the taper. As I utilize the tone control, turn it down, it should get more bassy. And between the two different caps, in this case, a 0.022 and a 0.047, I'm hearing slight different variations in the bass as I'm rolling off the tone control. This particular guitar is very bright. So right now I'm liking the sound of the 0.047 rather than the traditional 0.022 that you would normally find in a Les Paul. Here's another test you can try using the same setup. This one using two capacitors of the same value. One's paper and oil, the other one's ceramic. There's a lot of talk of which one sounds best. This will allow you to let your own ears decide. Here's a cool idea for a multi-tester. Using a rotary switch, I rigged up six different varieties of caps. It allows me to show customers how the different caps sound without having to do multiple changes in the guitar. I have it labeled for the different types, can run through each one and let them decide with their own ears.